Hey Tyler Scott, this is Mitch from the Trans Am Lovers page. Hey, I told you I was going to do this video for you in conjunction with your asking the question about rust and how to stop rust. I have to apologize because I can't speak today. I've got allergies and I can't even breathe. Since I have been out of here for three minutes, I've been asked twice if I want to sell the car. And of course, the answer is always going to be no. So here we go. Uh, I bought this car unseen. Of course, you all know it sat on your tree for 20 years, so when I got the car home, the first thing I did is pulled these vents off, which I did for you, to make sure, see how bad these were. And of course, I put my hand down the hole, and of course, I didn't know what I was going to find. Well, they're solid. No bundle whatsoever. So I was really, really happy about that. The second thing I did, pull the seat cushions out, of course. I got stuck in the rain last night. And I got stuck in the storm. Uh, I've got pin hose in the back. Uh, yeah, as you can see, the brackets are still there, but these will have to be addressed. Have to be patched. Not too bad. The front pans are perfect. Also, also, I couldn't believe the door under the door. Nothing. They're all clean. The rails are clean as well. Now, the way the car sat, the car sank in the mud, and the car tilted to the right. So this side right here was actually on the ground. Um, the axle was on the ground. So the water ran out of this side of the car. That part right there is dead. The inner, inner, the inner skin is fine. That will have to be replaced. So the car ran out. These right here, as you can see, are solid as well. And we know this is where the car rusts out as well, but the car, the water didn't stay in there, so it ran out, it ran out to the side. Of course, right here, we have rust. I'll have to, at one time, one time, replace this uh, trunk lid. I don't think they can fix that. Now, another place this car rusts out, the rear balance right here. If you can see, it's solid. Um, I get lucky with that as well. So this part of the car right there was under was actually on the ground. Uh, had things growing inside the car. Let's see, what else? This side, this port panel, is in very, very good shape. No rust, no patching. It's fine. Also right here, I don't want to get you. Surface rust, this is what I'm talking about. Surface rust. Weld marks from the factory where they put the, the roof on. No rust. Even right here, no rust. Just surface rust. Nothing going through. I also checked the door jam there. It's also totally 100% totally intact. The doors are, you know, perfect shape. I got lucky. Um, don't know how I did, but I did. Sorry if I'm shaky. That's interesting right there. A little spider web going on. Of course. Surface rust. So I don't know. You can tell me how long does sur surface rust on these cars last? If we keep it dry, will it stay this way? Um, very interesting how this thing really looks in person. You see all this. So the question I have, just like Tyler Scott said, uh, how long does a car rust, or will a car rust if it stays dry? You can uh, let us know. I'm in, I'm eager to, to know as well. All right, thank you guys, and we'll chat with you later.